Hey, welcome all to another edition of the expedition clues I've been making here, guys. I want to welcome you and say, hey, look at this, man. I got um, a lot more options than a trail hiker just wearing, a, say, a pair of these, right? You got the... Uh, the Dick's Sporting Goods best here. They got one pocket here for about two pairs of socks. Maybe a Leatherman and a Light or whatever, but very basic. You need, in a survival situation, you can never get injured. To be injured by a scrape of a rusty nail or a, a little bit of barbed wire or whatever would be, would, be, would be catastrophic. You can't get injured. On this thing, but I'm just I'm just playing with the, the different scenarios. It was um, it was so good to see how uh, um, like a tarp, for example. A lot of people don't know, but a tarp is like the golden boy in uh, in survival. You just wrap yourself up at night and at least keep the rain and wind off you, man. So the um, the different combinations have been fun to play with. I've had uh, a couple things fall out overnight, like. Uh, this here, I've lost like a glove and, and stuff, but I'm enjoying it. It, it, it really works. I got a, um, as you know, it's got the four license plates in the different, different legs here. Protection across one of the most critical areas to get injured right here. Very, very, worse than the groin. Um, there is, by the way, this in the legs. I don't know if you guys could all see this very much, but on top of being reversible, four layers, these pants, for example, they also have in the middle here this awning-like canvas, what would you call that, like a chat. And then on top of that, is a five inch wide belt that'll ride down that whole way so there is a version a shortened version there now but and then it's insulated on the back this obviously provides major insulation off the ground by the way this is so critical not only does it protect you from falling off and hitting a guardrail but it keeps you off the ground when it's when it's time to, to, to sleep on the cold ground it's it's like a ground mat right there and doing a job protecting you from any kind of briars and you know even even a, even you know hopefully not but a, you know some kind of dog or boar attack would be a, at least minimized to some degree so by you can't get injured so no scrapes, no uh, no dings. Even just scraping your knee could limit how you walk for like a, a month or more. So it's a breakaway. I, I I don't know if I could say this enough, but it's a breakaway from the from the standard talked about. It's 50 foot of cord in the way. That's, that's what I'm saying. Look at this. There's 50 foot of cord in there right now. And you don't even really notice it in here. There's, there's, it's, it's everything. There's, what, there's a, there is a um, hand digging spade right there. So these things seem to be fitting pretty well. And yet offering... My God, I, I can't stress this enough. And I talk about it here, here and there. Don't leave your gear behind. Don't don't set like um, your gear bag down and maybe go gather some water. That separation of gear just is, is so. You, you don't think about it as as you as you maybe just wander five more feet. Oh, there's a battery right there sitting. No, you know, and you get wander off, and here comes somebody up the other way. So again, that major. Uh, protection probably about 40 layers thick on the knees remember this is reversible to uh, uh, the field green color which uh, actually doesn't have uh, these outside pockets but has the deeper inside ones for these uh, the new designs are a, a little bit different but again this is the uh, you know what this is a great pair of pants 
Compared to a pair of jeans, this is probably five times better than. Uh, it's double layered in the knees. It's water, basically waterproof, water repellent. It's got at least double the capacity of pockets, even though it's minor. And I could even pull these on over this. I've had even as loaded as it was with a pair of uh, sweatpants over this. So it, 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 then you could <laughs> then you could just look like that the normal vagabond walking up and. Anyway, so this is one layer, two on the knee. This is four, five layer, and maybe 40 in the knee. All protection through here. Again, it's a, looks like a, a, a 10, eight layer seam in there as well. So about the only thing protecting this inner part here. If you have anything in your pockets, uh, um, even a, a, a flashlight or a candle will, will add protection in there. But the funny part was, and this is how this all kind of started, was, hey, I put on these uh, these top quality pants, right? And I'm going, wow, I could put a sock in there. And I said, fuck that. So I rolled it all up and I stuffed it into the bottom of this pocket here. And then on top of it, I said, wow, that fit. And then on top of it, I... I walk back and I take the, a, a similar shirt as this and stick that in there and a pair of long underwear. So everything that I had in one gear bag fit that one pocket to get me fully dressed. And then I'm like, geez, man, if, 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 if that only fit four pairs of socks and I could put that whole outfit in there, there's a dry pair of clothes in case I, uh, in, in case I get wet. I seem to be fully mobile in every sense of the word. Again, falling off a bike, hitting a guardrail. Uh, this could be better fabric, fireproof, and uh, uh, more water repellent. Yeah, just about five times if, it, if I get some decent fabric for that. The one thing that also struck out Is this new jacket right I was hoping for gold and to be honest it was a, a major find I'm able to uh, bury the belt height by about five eight inches and I tell you what, this thing is so solid, right? This thing is so solid, I'd probably, I'd probably be down to, to a good, you know, minus 20 and, and get one more thing on my uh, body here. This worked really great. As you saw, I could put all sorts of stuff in the, in the backpack. Had about everything I needed. It was, um... You know, just think about a, a backpacker. All you guys do, right, is walk down a pruning trail, something that's not got too many sticks or branches or trees to step over. You get your family to uh, the campsite and you're out there fishing. That's a nice weekend with a backpack. Typical camping type gear is just meant for that, a weekend out. You have no sears to go back to if you... Um, You know, break a zipper or uh, or tear your tent. You know, there's no another one to get. So you got to have something that this is a uh, five layers. Okay, so this is major uh, license plates in here. I'll probably talk about this more in another video. I'm still still playing with this. All right, thanks for your time.